वेरी क्लोज फ्रेंड ऑफ माइंड जिसके साथ मेरी आजकल लड़ाई चल रही है एक्चुअली तो उसकी प्रॉब्लम प्रॉब्लम ये है कि उसका डेटिंग स्टैंडर्ड बहुत ही लो है ठीक है इट्स रियली जस्ट दैट लाइक यू नो हाउ यू हैव चॉइसिस ऑन टेंडर लाइक ओ एथनिसिटी ब्लैक और एशियन एज ग्रुप दिस उसके लिए एक सेपरेट चेक बॉक्स होना चाहिए स्कम ऑफ द अर्थ बिकॉज दैट्स द टेस्ट शी हैज इन मैन सो दिस ईयर वी हैव एन एक्टिविटी प्लान शी वॉन्ट्स मी टू गेट अ सरप्राइज टैटू फॉर हर सेल्फ ऑन हर बर्थडे ओके दिस इज द सरप्राइज तो ऐसा रो के खूल and she said i wanted for my lower back and i was like of course you slut so <laughs> like, she's like still stop being aggressive you know you're kind of an aggressive person i was like chup ka bhangi lori mujhe kuch pata so she's like i want a lower back tattoo can you design it cuz you're like kind of artsy and shit i was like okay cool yeah i'll design it but i have an interior motive and i know she thinks it's going to be some kind of a hibiscus or rose flower or something what is it really going to be it's going to be my face like this <laughs> on her lower back ताकि जब नेक्स्ट टाइम गलती करने निकले झुके आई एम राइट देर एट द गाय जस्ट गोइंग बैक एंड फोर्थ जस्ट उसकी गान के साथ अगर कुछ गलत किया आई नो आई एम मेकिंग इट लुक लिल सेंशुअल इज द प्रॉब्लम नो इट्स लाइक दैट रियली लाइक आई की प्रॉब्लम कर आप मेरे साथ ही रहे हैं उस जोक में बाकी सब छोड़ गए थे ही रियली फॉलो द प्लॉट इज लाइक हाँ हाँ ये पहुंच रही है <laughs> इसके साथ भी कुछ गलत हो रहा है <laughs> मेरी उसके साथ लड़ाई क्यों रिसेंटली बिकॉज शी स्टार्ट टू गिव मी वन लेक्चर रैंडमली बिकॉज आई टू कम्प्लेन टू हर अबाउट सोशल मीडिया नंबर आई लाइक यू नो आई रियली गेट स्ट्रेस आउट बाई दी सोशल मीडिया नंबर नंबर ऑफ फॉलोअर्स नंबर बिकॉज इन माई प्रोफाइल आई हैव बिजनेस प्रोफाइल नाउ एंड दे मेक लाइक ग्राफ्स आउट ऑफ योर फेलियर दिस इज लाइक ये देखिए ये ये आपकी मुंडी ऐसे थी और फिर आपने जोक जोक किए फिर आपके बड़े बड़े फॉलोअर्स बढ़ते गए बढ़ते गए और फिर आपने उस दिन मेंटल हेल्थ की बात कर दी और फिर आयरनिकली आपकी मेंटल हेल्थ की तरह आपके फॉलोअर्स आई डोंट नीड दैट आई डोंट नीड अ ग्राफ ऑफ माय फेलियर इन माय लाइफ सो आई कंप्लेन टू हर अबाउट लाइक मैन दीज नंबर रियली स्ट्रेस मी आउट इट जस्ट लाइक यू नो दिस जस्ट आई डोंट नीड दिस इन माई लाइफ एन एक्स्ट्रा थिंग आई विश आई माई जॉब डेंट हैव टू डू विद नंबर्स and she was like you know you don't have to let the numbers measure your worth sajal <laughs> this is not her accent but it is now that i'm pissed off with it so, it's like it's, you know sajal uh, come on you don't have to let the numbers they're worth nothing but the problem with this argument is numbers are literally used for measuring that's that's the whole point of numbers otherwise why would i stress out about them so much The problem is we've taken numbers too seriously. That's what I've realized. The problem because I think they were they were invented to make our lives easier to like create shortcuts. Like it's much easier to say, hey, this morning I had five biscuits instead of saying, you know, if you didn't have math, you would have to go, oh, this morning I had biscuit, 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 biscuit. <laughs> Which takes a lot. But God forbid you have noodles and you're like, man, noodle, 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 But we've taken it too seriously now. The numbers. So now they're just like, especially these math people. People who are good at math, they always have like this condescending look about them, which that's what I hate about it. Because math used to be easy. It was so fun, like before, you know, when it was just addition, subtraction. Although now I can't remember that. Also, like if <laughs> if I'm in an auto and I have to give instead of GPay, I have to do like an actual cash transaction. It's like, ma'am, आपका एक सौ सत्रह हुआ, and I have a five hundred rupee note. उसके बाद वो कोई भी change दे दे, मैं accept कर लूँगी. Like like man, this is like 117, 100 separate from 17 is a separate seven. Actually, 100 minus 17 is 20. अगर हटा दो तो 80 हो जाता. तो तीन extra हटाने. Kind of moonwalk in my head is like 20 to 18, 17 to 20. To 20. I just don't know how to do this math. This is like I have to draw. It's like sir, one second, I have to buy a pen. So first, I have to take a notebook. Take a pen. First, I have to do math. The problem with math is also they have they have invented a lot of you know units for math, like a lot of measurements. Like when we started out, there was very simple measurement units like meter, centimeter, millimeter, kilometer, all from the same families. Like Agarwal or his brother Piyush Agarwal or Anand Agarwal or you know these surnames I understand. Then suddenly they introduced inches. Yards, acres, feet. Where did this come from? Math's beat me. 
So what is the food doing? And my food is not even 12 inches. How do I even decipher this? Because my food is like six and a half or five, seven or something. I don't know. My land is also small, so I don't know. It will be the same as the measurement. Same, I have no idea. The unit that I'm most confused by is the light years unit. You guys know about light year? So, Ma'am, you know? Oh, you know what it's a measurement of? Distance. You knew, you knew it? Everybody knew this? You didn't know it. Of course you didn't know it, you fab India lady. You will study arts. Okay, okay. No, no, I've seen it. 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 Arts is a math. No, it's not me. Because light years, the ending of the unit is years, which is time. So it's completely understand. But apparently it's distance. It's the distance that light travels in a year. Firstly, I did not know that light travels like this. You know? I didn't know because apparently Earth is eight light minutes away. It takes sun like eight minutes to come to Earth. Because I, I did not know that this was possible. I thought light comes on like, hello, <laughs> hi. <laughs> Switch on, kya, subha, okay, good morning. <laughs> I didn't know it was coming by a little jog like, oh, 263 more days to go to Pluto. Abhi wahan pe raat chal rahi abhi bhi. Chale ja hai sun over time. I just did not know about this. The worst part of math is when they, you know, they give you these riddles to solve. That's my worst one. These riddles in the middle of Candy Crush or some other stupid game you're playing. Two zero four. It. वो तो मैं game ही avoid करती हूँ. Just fuck that game. It's like math for fun. Fuck you. I don't want to do math for fun. But these, you know, these little games that they have. Sometimes they have this ad, and they always have like a really threatening tone to it. Firstly, they're just like, hey, ninety nine percent of the people can't solve this problem. Are you one of the one percent? That can because 99 plus 100 already test one passed. <laughs> Sir, are you ready to solve this riddle? Sir, I have an actual riddle. This is not a hypothetical joke. Are you ready, sir? You're not? Well, here it comes. <laughs> Gun to your head, sir. Get ready, okay? No stress. Which one of the following is heavier? A kilo of feathers or one kilo of stones? <laughs> Stones? Thank God, sir, your hand is made of ungly. Because otherwise, you would be dead right now, sir. And, but I get it. I get the confusion. Like it's just, the answer is, you know, where, where are you? Are you the art student trying to redeem yourself? <laughs> no, it's you, Chashme Wali. Of course, you're good at maths. These maths and bad eyesight are one with the Which What's the answer, ma'am? Both of them are a kilo, sir. You knew that or did you, did you just act like, like you're stupid for my joke because you thought that's... I just don't want condescension. <laughs> Aap genuinely stupid ho ki aap condescending ho. Just... <laughs> Sexy banne ki zarurat nahi hai, sir. <laughs> Show chal raha hai, mein yaan professional ghadi ho. The answer is both apparently because both are one kilo. But it doesn't make any sense. I agree with you. A one kilo of stones, I mean, what I answered was feather because I was like, a trick question. Hoga. <laughs> one step ahead. But the answer is both, which makes no sense because, you know, if you actually have a pillow fight with one pillow full of feathers and one pillow full of stones, I will get like, you know, the person being hit by feathers will just get like a poof. The other person will bleed to death. This is not a fair question. But the thing with math is it just keeps chasing you. Like on toxic X, it chases you. No matter, no matter what profession you're in, it keeps chasing you. Like I don't need maths in my life, but it's there in the form of money. It's in my pocket for some reason. It's there. I have a 10 rupee note just for this purpose because I noticed on a 10 rupee note recently. I know you're murja hai, hai fool ki tarah hai, but I have studied recently on it and I have seen that in it there are 25 languages in it. 10 rupees, 10 rupees, 10 rupees, 10 rupees, and it just goes on. In every language. Because this, in case you can't read this one zero here, they write it in the smallest font. Then they make a chashmah on the side, like, you need this for reading. And the Just a side note, guys, you're making a lot of money. Anyway, continue. <laughs> Shoo and drop down. No, no, but do it, do it. I enjoy it too. So I noticed this in the back. And then in the front, I noticed that it says, I promise to pay the bearer the sum of 10 rupees. 
with a signature that says <laughs> okay <laughs> firstly you, it's a promise apparently i thought this whole time it's a 10 rupee note but apparently it's a promise to pay the 10 rupee note which makes no sense this is not even a 10 rupee note this is just one promise i by some guy i don't even know personally <laughs> He could, he could be a wife beater for all I know. How do I take his word for it? So I decided if I owe somebody money in the future, what I'm going to do is I'm going to print my own note. I'm going to print my own note instead of Gandhi. I'm going to print my own note because like, this is smart. Hi hai. Hai? And then I'll write on it like, I promise to pay the bearer. I promise to pay the bearer. A sum of 10,000 rupees. But actually, you know what? Yeah, no, you're right. It doesn't make sense either. What I should do, actually, you know what I should do? What I should do is I should print a 10 rupee note with the same exact thing and then write, I am 10 rupees. <laughs> I'll be like, actually, this whole time you were looking at promises. Yeah, asli wala. Jimmy, my